Countdown down goes. Let's roll that intro. What's going on YouTube and how's it going today? Been a minute since I did a video weather's been crap so I haven't really been able to get out and uh, ride this bike I'm on graveyard shift again which uh, yay <laughs> so you'll have to excuse the wind noise my visor is open because I haven't forgot to change it over to the clear shield still got my smoke shield on but basically I just wanted to see uh, this is the first time I've gotten to ride at night with this uh, new Sun Pie uh, headlight that I've installed on my bike so I just wanted to see how bright it is can I still get out down there I think I can go straight so yeah I just wanted to see how bright this is the first time I've been able to ride at night usually I'm uh, going to bed by the time it starts getting dark enough to uh, get out and ride so I might have to do an adjustment on this thing but I don't know it looks like it's doing pretty good right now with lighting up the, uh, the road ahead of me Never had an LED headlight before. All the other times I've been riding my bike, I've been riding it during the day. So I really don't know how bright this light's gonna be, but coming up to a real dark area here, so it's really gonna tell me how bright, how, how spot on this thing is. So yeah, this next section is pretty dark here. No street lights, so. But I got other cars coming around, so it's gonna not really work for me. There we go. Ah, fuck. All right, light this thing up. No, that's not bad. Lights it up pretty good. But I think I should probably do an adjustment. I don't know. I got a lot of dark sections of road ahead of me anyway, so I'll really get to see, as long as I don't see too much traffic coming towards me, I'll really get to see how bright this light really can be. Yeah, it looks like I'm gonna have to do an, an adjustment up on this headlight a little bit. There we go, nice dark section along here. Oh yeah, look at that, that fucking lights right up. That looks good. Looks good. So that's yeah, pretty bright on the high beam, I must say. Hopefully the camera would have picked that up. I'm not too sure if it will or not. Yeah, so I think this headlight costs about $60 USD. Uh, you just have to kind of Google search SunPie, S-U-N-P-I-E, <laughs> yeah, SunPie, and uh, yeah, it seems to be uh, not too bad, you know. A cheaper alternative to the uh, Harley-Davidson Daymaker, that's for sure, but I don't know how bright a Harley-Davidson Daymaker is because I don't know anybody that has one on their bike. But it pretty much looks like a Daymaker because I've seen a few of them on bikes, but yeah. Also, it seems like my light might be tilted towards the right, down and to the right, where it should be up a little bit and centered. So I'm gonna have to do an adjustment there. That's not gonna be an easy thing to do because you're gonna take that front fairing off to do that. Oh, here is a dark section. Can I get on? Oh yeah, fuck, it just lights right up. Look at that. that looks pretty damn good, actually. Off, on, off. So I don't know if you can see the street signs all lighting up. Anyways, that's just a short one. I'm almost at work now. Follow me on Instagram if you haven't already. Watch all over that like button if you like this. Stage dive on that subscribe button. We will slayer another time. Cue the music.